Hey, kids, Zacko the Clown is here. <laughs> Sorry I'm late. I was coloring my hair. <laughs> Let's see your car. Go! <laughs> and it's all tied up at zero. That's it. You go, sister. Kick him to the curb. Who needs husband? Nothing to lose. Bailey! Napoleon Bonaparte was the French military leader whose actions shaped European politics in the early 19th century. Born in Corsica, he was destined. One of Napoleon's favorite songs. Everybody! Je te plumerai la tête, je te plumerai la tête, et la tête, et la tête. Cody, what's going on? Okay, the truth is, I didn't do the assignment. <gasps> yes! Even I did the assignment! It's just lines you made testing lipstick colors. <laughs> yeah, but it was on time. <laughs> you will be in the seahorse suite, and I'll get someone to help you with your bags. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, the classic. Zach, you rigged this thing to punch me in the face? Of course not. I rigged it to punch you in the stomach. I forgot how short you are. <laughs> that's it. I've had it with your stupid pranks. I only did it because you yelled at me last week. Well, that's because you put glue in my shoes. Look, Mr. Mosby, what we've got here is your basic chicken-egg situation. Who knows what came first, you yelling or me pranking? Uh -huh. I think it was you pranking. Well, since you're yelling, I guess I'm up. Okay. <laughs> Someone must have uh, smuggled one on board while we were docked in Australia, uh, and it got loose. Yeah. Well, Ivana will always live on in our memories. <laughs> Attention, passengers and crew. This is not a drill. A killer crocodile is loose on the ship! She bought it. Hey, Cody. I have something for you. Ah! <laughs> Thanks, Zach. You're not afraid? What? What have you done with this banana? <laughs> So you're not afraid of bananas? Why would you think I'm afraid of banana? You stole my fifth grade paper on Louis the Fourteenth. How did you know? I always bury one bizarre paragraph in each of my papers before I archive them. Just a foil thieving slime like you. So you have no banana issues. <laughs> Please. If anything, I admire the banana for its hearty protective peel and abundance of potassium. But you can read all about that in my award-winning second grade paper, The Yellow Miracle. Please have a seat so we can do a few simple tests. I'm gonna ask you what you think about these pictures. I think you should have painted them with the lights on. No, they're ink blots, ambiguous images. What you see will help us understand what you're feeling inside. 
I feel that you're a terrible artist. <laughs> I didn't paint them! <laughs> now, what do you see? That's a banana! Making one of its scary faces right before it eats you! Huh? Okay. What about this one? <gasps> a bunch of bananas, getting ready to make me slip on them! Okay. And this? I see a woman. Oh, good, good. Stabbing me with a banana! <laughs> it's time to face the first banana! <laughs> I am so gonna get you. <laughs> now hit the banana! Bruise him! Oh, well, hold on a minute, let's not do anything but now! Ow! Ow! Oh, that's it! It's on! Good, good! What I ask where your degree is from? Shut it, monkey bait, it's your fault! in this position. Me? How is it my fault that you're unable to write a term paper? Uh, uh, it's not that I'm unable. It's just that it wouldn't have been as good as one of yours. Uh, Hit him again! <laughs> Nothing I ever do seems good enough. It's not always easy being compared to you. Uh, how do you think I feel? You've always been better at sports and girls and had more friends than me. <sighs> Academics is the one place I can excel and be my own person. Not just Zach's nerdy brother. I didn't know you felt that way. I didn't know you felt that way either. I'm sorry, man. <sighs> Me too. Why are you crying? My eyes still really, really hurt. <laughs>